I was just waiting for a frequency so I can it grabs the GPS data, feeds it in here. We have red here. Yeah. And is it lighting up there? Yeah, it is. And is your, you have green here. Yeah. Clear the data buffer. I'd put it back in. Somebody get a clock going, Andrew, and run it for a certain amount of time, then turn it off, and then double check it. It's on LSB. Is okay, change it to upper sideband. Okay, where does it say upper sideband? It's just you're changing the megahertz to go from lower sideband to upper sideband. Clear and function at the same time. Ready, go. There should be one control to cycle through the different frequencies. Okay, we're at one minute. I'll tell her when to turn it off. Uh, you know, I'm kind of a little nervous, but I'm pretty confident that, uh, that what we've put together will actually work and we'll, we'll actually get the data that, uh, that, we have to, that we've tried to get, which is uh, correlating... Uh, correlating water vapor concentrations uh, to altitude. I hope we have a successful launch and recovery. I hope we get good data. If we don't, gosh, they've had uh, problem solving, critical thinking, collaboration, uh, lateral thinking, deductive reasoning, math skills, language skills, uh, growing up skills, first time experiences. Uh, so before we ever got here, it was a success, and I think that the success will continue long after the rockets landed. So, do you have any idea which of the three parachutes is our payload over? The rocket's just a vehicle for learning. Still getting data. Okay, we're going to go through disarming. All right. Uh, you ready, Tyler? I'm going to yes. turn the transmitter off. The quick link? Yes. Yeah, nice thinking, Josh. Nice yeah, thinking. I was worried about that, I have to admit. Do you want the beef sauce? Good job, guys. Success. Nice flight. Nice recovery. Yeah, I think we have data today. Good job, Andrew. Yeah. Well, it looks like if we've collected data all the way I down, can tell you in a minute. all of the all of the mission criteria have been met. I'm curious where these kids will be in five years because they're off to college next year. A couple of them interested in aerospace and engineering. You might be looking at the first astronauts on Mars. Thank you so much for, we had, I think we had an astonishingly uh, amazing launch. Thank you. This is our, our 11th year of uh, flying Arliss. We are from New Hampshire, and um, we're actually not a university. We're high school <laughs> students. Um, we like the promotion, though. Um, <laughs> we hypothesized that there would not be a significant change in water vapor concentrations and temperature. This has been an excellent opportunity for our team and we look forward to participating in Arliss and programs like it in the years to come. Thank you very much.